virtually every Republican campaign advisor is telling Donald Trump, look, bitch, you're losing. You got to stop attacking Kamala Harris. You got to stop calling her names. You got to stop talking about crazy shit. You got to focus on policy. Now, we know that Donald Trump doesn't listen to shit, but it would be interesting to see how it pans out. So the Trump campaign sets up an event tonight. It was in North Carolina. They called it an economic address, and they did that for two reasons. First of all, they figured if they called it an economic address, maybe Donald Trump will focus on economics. They also called it an economic address because they didn't want to call it a campaign rally because then they would have to compare their pittance of an audience against the big audiences that Tim Walls and Kamala Harris have every fucking night at their campaign rallies. So anyway, Donald Trump's going to go up and give his economic address. How do you figure that went? Exactly what you'd expect. He talked a little bit about economics, and then he went off the fucking rails, talking about Kamala and elections and all the crazy shit that he normally talks about. See, this is the thing. All these advisors know what Donald Trump needs to do, but they're under the impression that they can convince him to do it. Fact is, with Donald Trump, if you tell him not to do something, he's definitely going to do it. He's like an incorrigible child. You cannot control him. And every time you push him to do something, it's just going to get worse. And as time goes on and the pressure gets deeper on Donald Trump, he's going to get more unhinged and more crazy. He is on a sinking ship right now, and he can't help himself to save his soul. He's going to sink it if it kills him. 